what Dr. Rhodes has done for Austin, Austin's growth, uh, Austin's prosperity, is immeasurable. He sparked that fire in everyone about being innovative, but being innovative with a purpose. He was always saying innovation plus collaboration equals transformation. And boy, did he do that at ACC. He sees things that are possible, and he doesn't ask why we can't do it. He just says, well, how can we do it? Richard is a wonderful person and a wonderful friend. He's a runner. He runs almost every single day, and he uses that dedication not only for his own personal growth, but for helping students. Never tell Dr. Rhodes that you're a runner. I made the mistake one time of mentioning that I'd started jogging. Mind you, jogging, not even running. And before I knew it, he was recruiting me for a several day long, miles and miles marathon. One of the things I noticed right, right away with, about Richard was he cares about students. He spends time with students. Uh, he has other people realize that we're here to meet and greet, serve the students. Now, all this goes back 40 years. You know, he was 12 years old, I think, thereabouts. Dr. Rhodes propelled numerous initiatives to put Austin on the map for talent development. One of his key things was creating 11 campuses during his tenure. That's unheard of. I would say he's the godfather of early college. We created these career academies where students can earn a level one or a level two certificate while they're in high school in a high demand, high wage career. I had this idea about trying to inspire young people while they're in middle school and high school. The first person I went to see was Richard. And Richard Rhodes and his staff looked at me and I thought, yeah, I think they thought I was crazy, but you, Richard is too, so that's good. He said, let's go, let's do it. And my first partnership of purpose with ACC and him in the Make It Movement. He prioritized workforce development. He, he transformed the college from just being about college transfer to really about college preparation for a local workforce. And that was really a game changer and how we work together and I think how ACC was seen in our marketplace. So when some of these big organizations like Tesla, Apple, Samsung, when they came to Austin and they were looking for talent, the talent that they needed could easily be achieved through partnerships with ACC. We were the workforce workhorse. We are the workforce workhorse. And uh, Dr. Rhodes quickly made sure that everybody in town knew that. Department of Defense partnered up with Austin Community College to create this very unique unit for soldiers to go and find the problems within our United States Army. And then they are able to create those software applications to help the operational army. So thank you to Dr. Rhodes. Uh, it's one of those partnerships which will always be, be lasting and hoping that there will be a lot of many others to come. He's an inclusive leader. He's flexible. He wants to hear many different voices at the table. He's trusting and on top of everything else, he's kind and compassionate. A lot of people said, well, the colleges are there to give people a right to try, a right to, to try and see what they can do. R Richard would be characterized by a person who would say, the open door is one thing, but we need to do more than hold the door open. I also really appreciated that he would say yes before he'd say no. He doesn't tell you what to do. He doesn't get mad. He just guides you in the right way. And sometimes it's frustrating, <laughs> but it's effective. He's an eagle. He's always gonna build a better nest. Whether it's ACC or where he's now with his wife and family. I think what I've learned most from observing and watching Dr. Rhodes has been about not just being a mentor, but being a sponsor. The sponsor is someone that speaks your name highly in rooms that you're not in. It's someone that puts you in rooms that you would never have imagined yourself to be in with different groups, but make sure that that table values your voice. So he didn't just pull up a chair for me to have a space.
He made sure my voice was valued. What really makes a place where I feel like I made those that came before me proud and that I can exhibit and model that same kind of leadership for others. He has mentored a lot of people along the way and people who may not have even seen certain gifts and abilities that they have. Richard sees that in them and encourages them to pursue their dreams. Richard always understood that fulfilling those aspirations was much more important than providing a specific roadmap of student, you have to do this. It's student, what gives you purpose? What gives you excitement? It is a privilege of the chairman of the board to select the next Austinite of the year. And uh, it was actually a very easy task for me because Dr. Rhodes just stood out in the community as really the right gentleman for the role. I love the guy. Congratulations, Dr. Rhodes. We are so proud of you and can't wait to see what you're gonna do in the future because you're definitely not retiring anytime soon. Congratulations, Richard. This is an amazing recognition. Of course, it happened behind me and behind Colette, but nevertheless, an amazing recognition. And we love you and we're proud to be part of the same club. Uh, we'll kid him later about deciding to be an Aggie. I mean, that'll, that'll undo a lot of good. <laughs> Some of the board members here have said, did you know he was going to be an Aggie? Mm, no way. No way. So, Dr. Rhodes, from your most favorite Aggie, congratulations on being named Austinite of the Year. I'm so happy and I'm so proud of you, Richard. Because I never call him Richard. <laughs> congratulations, Papa, on your Austinite Award. Congratulations, Dad. I can't think of anybody who deserves it more. We love you. Love you. Hey, Dad. Congratulations on being recognized as Austinite of the Year by your community. Uh, you've been my Austinite of the Year for about 11 years. And then my El Pasoan of the Year before that, and my Salt Lake City Person of the Year before that. Uh, just wherever you go, you're my Person of the Year. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of the person that you are. Congratulations on this award. Uh, we can't wait to celebrate with you, and we love you. Hi, Hi Papa. Papa. Congratulations. Good job, you won. We're so proud of you. We are so proud of you, Papa. We love you. We love you. We love you. We love you. Hello. I'm here to present the award for Austinite of the Year. An extraordinary man and a Visionary, Dr. Richard Rhodes! Yay! Thank you all for coming. It's an honor to receive this award and see so many of my loved ones. Yay! Papa, good job! Oh, look at the time. It's about my bedtime. Good night, everybody! Congratulations, Richard, on being named Austinite of the Year. I can't wait to see what the future holds for us.